I don't think there are any global leaders today. I wish there were. But I don't, whether you take the West or the Third World, I don't think we have that kind of imagination. Two, I don't think we have that kind of experience which can go across West and East, North and South, developed and underdeveloped. We need an imagination which can do that. Right now, we have managers, we have technocrats, we have no leaders. I think a leader is a different kind, uh, imagines the world in a different kind of way. I don't think we have that. So whether it is Manmohan Singh or Angela Merkel, they fall short of what I would call leadership for a global world. And I think that's the real tragedy today. I think listening is actually being open to the imagination of the other. And I think that's really what's important. Because if democracy doesn't have a hearing aid, then it's, it's, you're only sending messages. But to receive messages, you have to understand the other. You have to translate the other. You have to imagine the other. You have to think you are the other. To do all that, I think listening becomes an art form. And I think that becomes very important.